giving you to a cover and saying, Son of man, here I am, taking away from you the thing desirable to your eyes by a blow. And you should not be, you, sh you should not be your breast, neither should you weep. Nor should your tears come on and sigh without words for the thing Dress fine on yourself in the sandal you should put upon your feet. And you should not cover over the mustache and the blood of men. You, you should not be. And I proceeded to speak to the people in the morning, and my wife gradually died in the evening, so I did in the morning. Just as I had. People kept saying to, to me, will you not tell us what these things have to do with us that you are doing? Then I said to them, the very word of Jehovah has appeared to me. Say to the house of Israel, this is what the sovereign Lord Jehovah has said, said he. I am proclaiming my sanctuary and the pride of your strength. The thing desirable to your eyes and the object of your soul's compassion. And your sons and your daughters, meaning you people, have left behind by the, by the sword, sword they will fall. And you will have to do just as I have done mustaches, you will not cover over the blood and the blood of, of men, you will not eat, and your headdress will be upon up on your head, heads, and your sandals will be upon your feet, you will not eat yourself, nor will you weep, and you will have to rot away from your ears, and you will actually groan over one another. And Ezekiel has become for you a portent in the accord with all that he has done. You will do when it, com when it comes. You will also have to know that I am the sovereign Lord Jehovah. And as for you, O son of man, will it not be in the day of my taking away from them. Therefore, trust the beautiful object, object of their exaltation in the desirable things to their eyes, in the longing of their souls. Their sons and their daughters, that in the day, in, in that in the day there will come to the escaped one for making the ears hear. In that day, your, your mouth will be open to the escaped one, and you will speak and be mute no longer, and you will certainly become to them a portent, and they will have to know that I am the sovereign of Jehovah.